If you're a law firm and you're growing or your intention is to grow, but your current experience of growth is chaos and you wonder, how do these big firms ever get to where they are? Then click the link below. I have a series of assets that will walk you through a step-by-step -step plan for creating a process-dependent law firm, one that can run profitably and smoothly, whether or not you're there. So first let me say, you did not start your law firm to be stressed out and overwhelmed, but this is almost always what happens as you find some success and you begin to scale. You imagine a better future, one with control, the freedom to be able to do what you wanna to do, to be able to make a difference in the lives of your clients and of course, make some good money. But the problem is you don't know how to achieve these goals because the firm that you're imagining is bigger and better than your current situation and your current experience of growth is things getting out of control. Things get stressful, overwhelming. For most, growth tends to equal more stress, more chaos, and less freedom to do the things that you wanna do. My name's Michael Mills. I'm one of the founders of Business Design Corporation. We're the developers of a simple and effective process implementation tool called the Touchstone Business System. And we've been helping owners of law firms, just like yours, build process-dependent businesses for more than 20 years. So what does that mean, a process-dependent business? Well, to scale and to achieve the better future that you're envisioning, the one that you can imagine having, you're going to have to have processes and procedures in place. The instructions for training and holding your team accountable. It just makes it easier to train new employees and manage existing employees, and it creates consistency and reliability to make sure that everything is done the way you need it done, whether or not you're there. Things cannot depend upon you. You have to be able to effectively delegate tasks to others. Now, you may have read a book called The E-Myth, Why Most Businesses Fail and What to Do About It. It's a great series of books by Michael Gerber. He's also written a book on this topic specifically for lawyers called The E-Myth Attorney. In these books, Michael makes a case for the importance and value of having documented processes. The problem is he doesn't explain how. How do you create a process-dependent law firm? Well, that's what we do, and we've been doing it for more than 20 years. You see, creating a process-dependent business is so much more than just documenting a bunch of processes. Following that path just churns up a bunch of your time and energy and gets you to a place that we often call SOP chaos. Your processes, they're all over the place, they're in all different formats, they're not current, no one's following them. If you've tried to systematize your business and this has been your experience, you are not alone. We speak to hundreds of entrepreneurs annually who are in this place of SOP chaos. And if you have not yet tried to get your firm to be process dependent, let me save you hundreds of hours of wasted time and frustration. To build a process dependent law firm, you're gonna need two things. You're gonna need a process implementation plan and you're gonna need a process implementation tool. If this piques your interest, click the link below. Grab the short document that outlines the five-step plan for creating a process-dependent law firm, a plan that we've created from our 20-plus years of experience working with firms just like yours to get them to a place where they can scale with control and consistency. And stay tuned for some additional assets like org chart creation, vision building, and a complete list of processes that really every law firm needs. Click the link below and take the first step in creating the business you deserve.